Hello everyone and welcome back to In Stars and Time. Uh, last time we continued our trek through the castle. We're basically on a big dungeon crawl right now mm -hmm. is the best explanation for it. Uh, we found some hidden rooms along with some secrets that may reveal uh, a little bit about about Sif and where they're from, potentially. Potentially, maybe, unconfirmed. Unconfirmed, uh, we're not quite sure yet. So we are just, we're continuing our trek forward to uh, make it to the king uh, through the time-possessed uh, castle covered in hair. Indeed. <laughs> oh, oh, that must be where we're gonna use our crest. I think this is right. Yep. Yeah. Okay. We, we did the right half uh, last time and this time we're doing the left half All of right. this floor. Uh, we'll go to the crest in just a moment. Let's do this. Yep. Someone is frozen in time. Oh, oh that's the pottery teacher. She doesn't like me. I broke the whole class's work during what the last class I had with her. Oh, what? Oh no. How did that happen? Everyone's finished work goes on the shelf over there. And I bumped into it. A simple mistake. And it was fine. But then I tried to jump away so I wouldn't break anything. But I bumped into someone else. Uh-oh. Who bumped into someone else? Who bumped into someone else? And so on. Until someone bumped into the table flipping it over. Right into the shelf. <laughs> Wish I could have seen it. Yes, this sounds quite entertaining. How many people died? <laughs> Only two. <laughs> we don't talk about them though. <laughs> Some weird tools to make pots. You forget what they're called. We had to make clay figures in memory of them after. <laughs> Say those statues are still in this room. <laughs> <laughs> no, Mirabro broke those too. No! <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh my god. Pottery wheel, Sif. Ah. Uh, an open book, stained by clay and dirty hands. It's an issue of the Cursing of Chateau Castle, issue 87. 87. Issue 87? You should remember this number. Deep. Did All right. we find an 88 somewhere? I didn't think so, but now that you're saying it, it's making me <laughs> doubt. <laughs> I was like, surely that is the latest one that we found. But it, it's certainly up there. Now I am doubting. A broken figure of the changed god. There's some unused clay here. Got lumpy clay. I want to work in clay again. Me too. I'm actually. Oh. Uh, I'm gonna take a glass blowing class soon because I like. I want. I want to do physical. We should do one of those like pottery and wine things. Yes. Uh, <laughs> oh my god. Let's be obnoxious and do a pottery and wine thing. How have we not done that before? I don't know. Actually, I mean, now that I'm saying. <laughs> I guess because we went to art school, we were kind of like. And bah. it seems incredibly yeah. like basic and bougie, but yeah. also. I love. I, I, it's been so long since I've thrown anything on a wheel. Uh, I've actually never thrown anything really? on a wheel. Really? Yeah, I didn't. My, I, I almost concentrated in clay. I in, remember that. You, and you've done a ton of like beautiful clay sculptures Thank and you. things like that. Thank you so much. But I didn't do pottery. Mm -hmm. Like, I, it was so funny because if you wanted to learn pottery at that school, you had to kind of like go to the pottery teacher at like after hours and be like, hey. Can you teach me how to throw on a wheel? Yeah, there's no class yeah, there for like actual <laughs> just like ceramics. Yeah. Yeah. And it'll be like, I got you. And like you would have to basically have one on one tutoring mm -hmm. with the professor to learn how to, that to seems throw. So silly. I know, right? Isn't that weird? Yeah. There was no like actual pottery class. There was like clay sculpture class. Mm -hmm. Um but I don't that's know. That's so interesting. I, Cause I did like ceramics in high school. Uh huh. So I did like, that's when I did, I learned how to throw on a wheel and things like that. That's so fun. Yeah, even in high school we had ceramic, ceramics class and I we didn't do hmm. wheels then either. I don't know, it's very interesting. So all, all of my, all my clay work is just like sculptural. Yeah. Absolutely. But, yes, 100%. Let's go make mugs and get drunk. That <laughs> yes, sounds yes, that awesome. Yes, sounds really fun. <laughs> or just oh. drink wine and <laughs> and make bowls. I love, how, I love how I didn't even default to like, let's go if, like to a ceramics class. Like I picked, <laughs> no. I picked the dumbest, bougiest option, but it does sound really fun to me. <laughs> it's really fun. <laughs> I know. Oh. We're at that point in our lives. You know what? And I'll, I will embrace that fully. <laughs> oh. 
Uh, you put the clay in your pocket along with your souvenirs. Oh, man. Uh, a shelf filled with little change gods. Look at all the little ones! They're so small! They're all different shapes and sizes. Some smiling, some crying, some with no face at all. Ooh. There's a box here. The box is filled with crafting materials and finished art pieces that no one liked. Including... Paper mache gloves? They're massive! They're not meant- uh, they're not made for a kid, that's for sure. Paper mache gloves? Wouldn't you, like, crunch? Yeah, like, what is that? <laughs> <laughs> What's the deal with that? Crunch. Mm. <laughs> you take the gloves and put them near Isabeau's hands. Oh my. A perfect fit! Isabeau bats his eyes. My dear Sifrin, would you do me the honor? You laugh and try to put the gloves on him. The stiff paper mache makes it hard, but after some effort, you succeed at your task. Are they like for for punching? Is that what they are? Are they weapons? Paper mache hands. How comfortable are they? Not even a little bit. <laughs> you got the paper mache hands. The paper mache hands are equipped to Isabeau. Let me see what those do. That's just how it is now. <laughs> <laughs> The paper, the paper mache hands are very special. When equipped, they turn Isabeau's basic attack <gasps> from rock to paper. Okay, that's cool. That's really interesting. But we do need him to be rock. Wait. Yeah. Wait. Take this off. <laughs> I don't. I don't want that. Uh. That makes way more sense now. Why? I'm like, why are they paper mache? Yeah. Oh. That's really cool. But no, not no. right now. But. Good to know going into a fight, if we ever have like something that's weak to paper, yes. we can we can load back and what make if, that happen. What about ceramic hands? Well, I guess those would also be rock. And yeah. they break. Yeah, yes. <laughs> well, yes and yes. Uh, where is the lumpy clay? It uh, is nothing but can become anything. Oh. You mold the clay into an egg. Egg. You're hungry. Always egg. hungry. <laughs> Let's see. The closet contains some tools to make pottery. There's also... You got two salty broths. Nice. Give them Bonnie. Here you go, Bonnie. I went on a weird little like Wikipedia journey last night because I didn't, I don't know how to darn socks. So I was learning how to like <laughs> mm -hmm. darn socks last mm -hmm. night via Wikipedia. And I learned about darning eggs, which you put in the sock to hold it, give it a round shape oh. that you can stitch around. Huh. Like it's usually an like an egg shaped thing, like an egg. Yeah, that's like a heel. Yeah, or a mushroom. There's also darning mushrooms, which are basically like little handles with a like a, a wide like rounded mm. piece on them to like put in your sock, and they're just painted like mushrooms. And I just think that's very. That's cute. really cute. Anyway, that's what I. No, I, I, you, <laughs> hey, Allison, you've taught me something today. Thank you. <laughs> I had no. I I too do not know how to darn a sock. Well, no, yeah, <laughs> and I'm like. <laughs> Because I, I have socks with holes in them. I'm like, I don't want to get rid of these. And such is the ancient craft of darning. <laughs> the, more. <laughs> the more you know. Uh, anyway, he made a darning egg. That's how I interpret that. <laughs> it is a ceramic. It, it, if, we're, if we put it in an oven for clay, we probably could make a darning there egg. There we go. <laughs> it has a name, but you can't remember it right now. Huh? It's oh. a kiln, Sifrin. Oh. Oh. This room is a, uh, hey, remember that Sifrin can't remember things room. That's right. He yes. didn't know that it was a kiln. He didn't know that it was a, uh, what was the other thing? Um, uh, a pottery uh, a wheel. A pottery wheel. Yeah. Yeah. The tear floats gently. Touch it. No, 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 no. 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 Living time. Sorry. I don't actually have a, I guess I don't have a crest. I think Let's we go still find have to crest. go to the left, right? Yeah. Yeah. Key, key time. time. Yes. You insert the key in the keyhole and open the door. Nice, nice, nice. Okay. Smiling. Mask key has been you another crest. Yes. Wall. Okay. Okay. Hi. Oh. Someone frozen in time. <laughs> Whoa. She's another house maiden. I always wanted to talk with her. Oh, she's so cool. Her crafted pieces are always so perfect. I want to be just like her when I grow up. Huh? But you're an adult, Belle. You're already grown. Oh no, she's realizing she's a real, actual grown adult. We all go through this realization, Mira. It'll be okay. Oh, no, uh, sorry. It's not that. It's, uh, uh, it's just... Do you not know how old I am? Oh. <laughs> she 
you look so scared. Oh, no, that's not the direction <laughs> it was going. I'm sorry. <laughs> She looks so scared. Hi. <sighs> Let's go, everyone. Please. Sure, Mira. There's a bunch of oh, three options. Where do you want to go? I'm going to fight this and then we'll <laughs> then okay. I'll, I'll, I will confront choice. <laughs> That's fair. Ah! I hate that. <laughs> I just beat the mic so hard. I'm sorry. You really oh, did. Look at it. That's your look problem. Look at what we're looking at. I'll deal with it later. <laughs> I'll deal with it later. Holy oh my shit. god. I don't know how I feel about that. Negative. Also, it's it's power. It's, it's up there. This is up there. This is a strong thing. <laughs> which means I'm gonna have to actually take it seriously. It's so tall. <laughs> somebody somebody in the comments was like, why don't you ever use like buffs in normal fights? I'm like, because normal fights are usually over in three hits. Yeah, like by the yeah. time I use it, it makes it longer. But this is clearly a, an actual scary thing. We need to we need to buff yeah. with this one. Oh my god. Look at that shit. Okay. While you're I'm doing this, do. I'm gonna close the blinds because I've got sunlight going right yeah, through my absolutely. eyeballs. Go for it. One sec. Oh, that's the wrong way. E e e <laughs> this is going great. This is going really well, Alice. I'm doing a good job. This is going really, really well. <laughs> Why did I do it like that? <laughs> Why didn't I just do oh it like God, a normal person? So <laughs> oh my God, I really play the game, Gina. Oh. Come on, you got this. I love it when you hit the big hands and then the little tiny body head kind of goes. E <laughs> <laughs> You're right, yes. <laughs> Oh. oh my gosh. Okay. Oh my god. Uh, your turn, Sif. I don't. <laughs> this thing's just in the castle and everyone's like, whoa. Whoa. What the heck? <laughs> All right, here we go. All go, everybody, deck. go. Ooh. Damn. Oh, it's hurting. Yeah. Uh oh, that's not good. Nope, it's not great. I agree. Hey, um, time. Shoot. Paper three? Oh, I guess so. No, wait, at paper. Sorry, this thing is paper. What yeah, am I talking about? but, but uh, I don't have a scissors attack right now. So, yes, we are going to do big paper. Big paper is fine. Yeah, cool. You breathe in and out. <sighs> <laughs> okay, well, that, that was an unexpectedly surprising fight. Wow, wow, big guy. Ooh. Ooh. And a little hole in the wall. A hole in the wall. The hole doesn't really bring you anywhere. Oh, okay. That's going to, okay, all right. What's this thing on the wall here? That's a great question. Give me a sec. This gate is locked. It's locked by one of those weird word locks. There's something written above the lock, too. Maybe you should take a, a closer look. Look at it curiously. Try to read what's written. Say change. Try to read what's written? You cannot read what is written above the lock. Just trying to read this makes my head hurt. Okay, so maybe a language from the, the island that disappeared? <gasps> Yeah, that's a great guess. Well, because there's been a couple of things that we couldn't translate. And I'm like, how are we going to learn a whole language? And I guess, you know, infinite loops, you could technically have time to learn, you know, Groundhog Day. But yeah, I think it's also possible that maybe Sif already knows the language and just doesn't remember it. Yes. And and if everyone else, you know, if other people could have known it, they can't now because that mm -hmm. knowledge has been excised from reality. Which is wild. Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. I'm going to look at it curiously and see if it lets us do that. Sure. You look at it. Isabeau sees you look. Have you never seen a lock like this before, Sif? It's a special kind of Valgardian lock. Instead of a key, it needs specific words to open. Words. Oh yeah, we haven't talked okay. about uh, open phrases in this. Uh, in this loop, right? Yes. Yeah, in this lo loop. Uh -huh. You just need to say the words out loud. I think they call it a uh, an open phrase. An open phrase. Fascinating. So, what is the phrase for this lock? I I don't know. Ah, so it's locked. Yes. Yahoo. The door has a sentence written above the lock too, that nobody can read. But you can't read it. Such an imposing door, though. I don't remember seeing it before. Hmm. There's some text written above the door, though. Look. It says, 
Ow! Yeah. No, no, it's just, ugh, my head hurts. Yeah, okay. okay. Definitely the language or something from the, the Lost Island. Yeah. Yeah, okay. I think so. Okay, to the left. Oh! Oh, that's... That's... That's my room. Oh! This yeah, is... I was about to say, I recognize this I from, say... from Start Again. Yep, yep. Uh, <laughs> it's Mira's room. Papers filled with complicated equations. A bed. That's my roommate's bed. Do you think she's okay? What is she like, this roommate of yours? She's the worst! I don't really like her! <laughs> oh, oh! I didn't know Belle could hate people. She doesn't clean her side of the room ever! And she leaves her experiments with weird potions around everywhere! And she always sigh sings way too loudly! And when I ask her to maybe change songs and sing something I might like, she always tells me no can do, princess! I can actually sympathize with that. I had a roommate that did that. <laughs> <laughs> that wasn't Gina. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> no, I just played a Digital Devil Saga and way too loud <laughs> in the middle of the room. It's fine. You didn't play Fireflies by Owl City on repeat yeah. every single I night. I lived next to you when you had the roommate that played <laughs> Fireflies way too loud on repeat at like three in the morning, but... God. Yeah, yeah, I remember that. <laughs> <laughs> it's a fascinating choice of songs. <laughs> really, truly. No, I I was always fine with your song choices. <laughs> <You're fine>. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> She's mean and has no respect towards others. So, a normal roommate. Maybe! <laughs> but, even so, not seeing her around really worries me. Hmm. Positive. Gotta stay positive. Uh, that was yeah. fun because I've definitely read that line before and I had like this weird like deja vu flashback <laughs> as I was reading it. Anyway, sorry. From like three years From ago. From three years ago, yeah. <laughs> uh, a closet filled with unsafe looking potions. Hmm. Was your roommate making bombs? Because with all the materials she has here, it looks like she was learning how to make craft bombs. What? No! Was she? <laughs> I'm just saying. Also, why do you know how to make craft bombs? Oh, you know, it's just a little, yeah, little <laughs> that was side my hobby. In my previous life. Yeah. <laughs> uh, she has the she has the materials to make a craft bomb. Looks like she didn't finish it though. If that makes you feel any better. How? Do you know how to make a craft bomb? <laughs> I, uh, I, I learned it while I was studying to become a defender. But, but isn't that just common knowledge? I've never learned that. I've never learned how to make a bomb! I know I'm a kid and you'd think I definitely know how to make bombs, but I've never learned either. O oh, okay. What else does it need then? Hmm. Why? So, uh, we have a we have to throw a bomb at the king. It'd be so funny. What? Yes, it would be funny. It would. But what else do we need? Your roommate has some stuff already, so we just need. Isabeau starts explaining what you need with very confusing words. What? Use simpler words, uh. Um. Uh, there's already a short gizmo gadget here, so we just need a long thingy thing and a secret ingredient. Oh, okay. Makes sense. It doesn't... Time to find those things! You got the short gizmo gadget. <laughs> you put it in the, sh the short gizmo gadget in your pocket along with your souvenirs. Now we just need a long thingy thing. A long thingy thing. We have the short gizmo gadget and then a secret ingredient. Yes. Okay. <laughs> we will cool. find those in subsequent loops. Awesome. Uh, one of them is broken, but the other seems intact. Just, we need to remember we got the clay from the pottery room. We got the short gizmo gadget from Mirabelle's room. We got the, the piece of paper from the library the, with the poem. Sorry. We, I, <laughs> we also need a passphrase. Yeah. We also could have tried change. We didn't say that, but I don't no, think it I, would I, work. I doubt it. Yeah. Um, All right. Uh, let's see. You got pepper juice. You got thyme juice. You got ginger juice. Give her the bonnie. Nice. Rolled papers. 
One sec. Okay. Is that a door? Yeah. What is that? This way must lead to a shared bathroom. Okay. okay. It yes, it was a door. It technically is, but you can't go in. Yeah. I was like, that? <laughs> that looks like some, <laughs> a walkway. The, close, uh, the closet has a lot of different dresses that look similar to Mirabelle's. Is this her closet? Huh. Hmm. Horror books. <laughs> There's the Cursing of Chateau oh. Castle, issue 68. Shit, we gotta go back and read the other one, right? I mean, we just need to, yeah, so it's the highest, if that's how that works. I, I don't know how. if that's how that works, but I, yes, we probably should. Okay. We'll go reset it to, to uh, 82 or whatever. Okay. Unless it unless it just overrides it. I, I guess we'll see. I don't know. Uh, death die dice maker. 100 ways to die horribly. The meat slicing. Ah. Uh. The last one's actually a cooking book. <laughs> Issue 68? You, know, you should remember this number. Damn it. A lot of horror books in there. Is this uh, is this one about a group of young adults being forced to kill each other for someone's entertainment? I've never heard of a story like that before. <laughs> who, who would ever engage with a story about young adults being forced to kill each other for somebody's <laughs> entertainment? <laughs> <laughs> never heard of that series no nope, never not even once not even one time mm -mm. certainly not three and a half no nope. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. we should have a book club sometime just the two of us we should we could exchange letters and recommendations after we beat the king what just you two the rest of us aren't invited no girls only yeah back off isabeau being told to back off by Mirabelle herself. I feel blessed somehow. <laughs> that was cute. <laughs> Mirabelle's dresser. It'd be rude to look inside, so you don't. Huh. Mirabelle is thinking about her roommate. Bed. Is that your bed? Yes. Um, what gave it away? It smells fruity, just like your name. Mirabelle Plums! <laughs> My roommate gifted me some Mirabelle plum scented soap a while back. Oh. She may never clean her room, and she, uh, and she may keep me from sleeping by muttering formulas to herself in the <laughs> middle of the night, but she she does give great gifts. Oh. Some flowers. I'm trying to grow them out. They haven't they haven't died yet, even though I haven't been here for months now. They're frozen in time. Yeah. <laughs> I suppose that's something I can thank the king for. Uh, you can't click on any of the hair, right? No, okay. you can't. Okay. Right. I think. Is I think that everything? I think we've done it. It's hard to tell sometimes. Barrels? I know. It's a barrel. It's full of various nuts. Wow. You have a bunch of barrels of nuts in here. That and one's got water. water. And it's nuts. nuts. <laughs> that's water. Again, okay. Now I'm like, I want to eat some nuts. I know. <laughs> <laughs> I agree. Like okay. some cashews sound great. Okay. Ooh, stuff. Ooh, yeah, there's things happening. Okay. Okay. A paper and a pen. Looks like someone was in the middle of writing down their change. You and Ode uh, Deal look closer. <gasps> hey, don't look. It's private. Just because everything's frozen doesn't mean we should look at everything, you know? Oh, I wasn't aware. My apologies. He's right. You look away. Nah, it's fine. It's fine. You didn't know. But still, this brings back memories. Uh, I would love to craft my body more. I would love to be two centimeters taller. Why two centimeters? Aren't you tall enough already? I think you're too tall and you should cut it out. Cut what out? Anyway, Mira, you don't understand. With two more centimeters, I'll pass the threshold. With two more centimeters, I'll finally be tall with a capital T! <laughs> I suppose you and your tall dreams. I support you and your tall dreams. <laughs> what a simple reason. Crafting your body, huh? And, you know, instead of crafting your body itself, maybe there are easier ways to gain height. Like tall shoes! Yeah. Oh? Like what? You could, you could wear high heels! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> I think shoes. I kind of get Mirabelle. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you could wear high heels. High heels hurt my feetsies. Me too. I can't walk. <laughs> <laughs> I wear high heels one day and I can't walk for like two weeks. Oh no. I've got literal Achilles heels. I can't. <laughs> I have weak little feet. Oh no. <laughs> Drink lots of milk. Uh. 
Milk makes me sick sometimes. We could tie your hands to a pillar and tug on your feet really hard. Worth a try. <laughs> Anyone have rope? I'm sorry, I brought us to this point. Let's stay focused, please. <laughs> Vile. Salty broth. Take that. Okay. Oh, yeah, this is a person. We didn't I should, I should on the person yet. click on the person. Hi. Hi. Someone is frozen in time. Oh, that's... I don't know who that is, actually. They have a cool necklace, though. Let me see. Oh, I know them. This is another housemaiden. I hadn't seen them in a while. I didn't know they were changing. Come to think of it, I hadn't seen them for a little bit before the king. Maybe they were close to done crafting their body. If we can beat the king, you can see them and meet them again. Yes! Okay, so there's body craft. There's body, body craft. Body craft, which is something that we hadn't really considered up to this point. I mean, I guess that's what Isabeau has done yeah. before. Like, he's talked about yeah, that. Yeah, that was definitely implied. Yeah. It's just like, I, I think this room is like, this is a formal, like, field of study. Yes. Or like, part of, yeah, part of things. Yeah. Uh, Some frozen flowers. They smell like flowers. Okay. What's on the bed? An empty, clean bed. There's something on it. It's an animal, uh, but not real. It's made out of fabric and other things. It's usually for kids. Those things have a name. It's a... Uh... It's a stuffed animal, dummy! Oh. Guys! Friend forgot an easy word again! Sifrin? Sif, we really have to do something about this, Sifrin. Did you really forget a basic word like stuffed animal? Hey, some of the things you don't remember for the words for aren't basic. I use my brain for other things. Things other than remembering the word stuffed animal. What do you, wait, what do you use your space in your brain for anyway? Puns? Oh, as a matter of fact, yes. Well, that's fine, but. My brain is just stuffed with puns. Crab! <laughs> yes! <laughs> that's uh, called deflecting. Yeah, <laughs> that's called deflecting, Sam. So. Don't look, don't look. <laughs> <laughs> Candles. <laughs> <laughs> Pomme de granate. Pomegranate. 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 Yeah! You did it! Everyone claps proudly. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> that was cute. Ah! <laughs> Some vials. Let's see. You got one pepper juice, thyme juice, ginger juice. Take there you those. go. The bookcase is filled with books about body craft. Interesting. Can you tell me more about this? Oh, uh, well. Hey, hey, Deal. Don't you already know all this stuff? Hmm? What do you mean? Um, you're always asking questions about Volgard and change and stuff. But don't you already know about it? Huh. You never thought about it. Yeah, I was wondering about this too. You're always asking questions, which is fun, but I can't believe you'd go to another country and not learn all about it beforehand. It only, it only, if only because it'd make you look stupid. <laughs> How insightful, you two. What? Do you already know about the things you ask about? Hmm, I do know some of the things I ask you about. But I also believe there's a difference between knowledge learned in books and knowledge learned by talking to people. Knowledge is important, but the meaning behind it, the emotional piece, that's important too. Books don't tell me anything about how it feels to be surrounded by a Valgardian culture, to be bathed in it. But the three of you do. And you clearly love your country, love the change belief, and it's making me like it too, I suppose. Oh. Oh, Madame Odile. I don't get it. <laughs> it's okay. You don't need to understand. I just want to know all I can about Valgardian culture. That's all. We didn't learn about body crap. But I want to learn about <laughs> body crap, though. Maybe that book? Yeah, probably. Know. Sorry. <laughs> just, it's, it's, I don't know. It always <laughs> amuses me where it's like, you should never be afraid to ask questions, and then they don't answer the question yeah. that was asked. <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, God. A book detailing how to... Yeah, okay, here we go. How All to right. craft your body. Wow, this book looks simpler than the one I've studied. Apparently, they've made big strides in body craft recently. Before, it took close to a year to make big changes. But now you can change in a month or so. It's interesting. Crafting your body is so accepted here in Vaugard. In Kabui, using craft on yourself would be grounds for prison. Prison? But why? Because if you can craft your body to your liking, where's the limit? Take the king, for example. They say he crafted his body to become so massive he can destroy houses in a single gesture. And that's without mentioning his mastery over time craft, too. But that's... I'm not saying Kabuya is correct. I'm just telling you their point of view. Plus, it's not like there aren't ways to do body craft in Kabui if you know where to look. Oh my, Madame Odile, were you part of the underground resistance? <laughs> I'll never tell. <gasps> Resistanceology! <laughs> That's what she studied. That's her study. <laughs> pictures of different people. Some of them are covered in bandages, but they're all smiling. Aww. The closet is filled with many different types of clothes. Oh, look at this shirt! It has the same material as your cloak, right, Sif? It also looks incredibly warm. I still don't know how you managed to wear your cloak this whole summer. You've had this cloak for a while. I never really, th I never really get hot with it, though. Really? Sif, can I take a look? Uh, Sif, can I look at your cloak for a sec? You nod. Taking care not to touch you, Isabeau kneels and takes a, uh, a hold of your cloak. Ah! Your cloak's been sewn with some kind of temperature regulation spell crafted into the stitching. That's kind of cool. No wonder you always look comfortable no matter the weather. Huh? What? Isn't that really, really advanced crafting? Oh, it's oh, it's also been crafted to make the cloak grow with you. It must have been incredibly expensive, unless it was handmade. How long have you had this? You try to remember. Nothing comes to mind. You have a really fancy, advanced, magical cloak. That you so don't remember getting powerful craft parents. Maybe. If it was designed to grow with us, we must have had it since we were, like, a you're, baby. You're right. Yeah. yeah. Oh. You shrug. Uh, I'm really jealous. Sorry. Yeah, if you ever sold this, you'd, uh, you'd be set for a few months, if not a whole year, you know? The craftsmanship alone. Crafting, crafting stuff into the stitching is really interesting, actually. Hmm. <laughs> Spoken like a true clothing designer, huh? <laughs> well, uh, did I tell you about that? Not in this <gasps> timeline, you didn't. <gasps> Oops. Quick say, it's really hard for me to keep track of what happened in town when we're in the castle because yes. we can jump back and forth uh -huh. so i really i know in i yeah i don't know it's just really hard uh quick say something just uh just just because your, your clothes are so cool oh <laughs> <Aww>, thanks mm. uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh look by accident i found a hole oh, oh my god, god. <laughs> <laughs> Well, it doesn't really bring you anywhere. Okay. Okay. It's not real. Now I have to cl click on all of the walls You're all of the time. Are you checking everything before you click yes, on the sparkle? that is exactly what I'm doing. I understand. Uh, yeah. <laughs> okay, here we go. Okay. A uh, closet. You open it. You found the angry key. Ooh. You put the angry key in your pocket. Nice. You now know where the angry key is. <laughs> <laughs> Keychain dangling from it is shaped like an angry mask. Uh, that, <laughs> that's a different face than the key you've gotten before. Why are the faces different? Does it mean something? What's this about? Oh, every keychain will probably have a different mask. Huh. So every mask will have a different emotion? Is this what it's trying to represent? Oh, I know this one! That's the change god! No matter what emotion it has, if it has a mask, that's the change god. The change god always has a mask! 
and never has the same expression. It's interesting that the keys aren't broken, but all of the statues of the change god are. I wonder why the king did that. Yeah, that is interesting. Very true. Yeah, I don't know. I just uh. was noticing, because you might have noticed the only thing in this room I didn't click on was the change god statue. It's just because it always feeds the same in, uh, info, but I will click on it, because cool. I should before we leave. Yeah. But yeah, I don't know. That's interesting. That is. Um. Uh, uh, or art style, for that matter. It's to show the change god is ever-changing, but also to show us that emotions are fleeting. No matter how wonderful or awful you're feeling, this feeling will fade in time. Why do good emotions have to fade too? Why can't we keep being happy forever? That'd be boring. Can you imagine? It'd be like, hmm, like being forced to eat your favorite food forever. I'd like that though. Are you sure? Really imagine it. Eating only your favorite food all the time? Can I stop eating it when I'm full? Nope. Can't do anything except ex wait. Expect yeah, it's can't just, do anything yeah. except eat. I can't go to the bathroom? Nope. That would suck. Indeed. Just like feeling terrible forever would suck too. And some of those feelings might stay for a while, make their home here. But knowing they will eventually go away, isn't it a relief? Hmm. Why is there, what are the Why holes? There, the I don't, what are the holes? I don't know. Okay, change god is a statue. The change god has been destroyed. Okay. okay. I just needed to verify that that was indeed. Okay. Uh, okay. So right. very uh, cool. I like the the body craft room. Absolutely. Um, very lot, very interesting. Lots of advancements in body yeah, craft. That's the door. Um. Okay. There are two. There are two, oh, is it going to be the big guy again? No. No. There are two um, crest walls here, but I need to go back to the right because we don't have crests and we need uh, to open the angry door. Yes. So just okay. wanted to explain what I'm about to do. Yeah, no worries. Um, this is a uh, Paper. Rock. Yeah. Let's go, cool. deal. Paper Ooh. alpha five. Big old paper. Turn it up. Ew. Oh, yeah. Wow. Uh, just obliterated God, that, that was dude. great. Also, that gave us half a, as much experience as the big guy did for Ooh. only one hit. So, like, that was actually pretty nice. Wow. Did I do this? I, yes, yes. That's pottery room. Yeah, okay. pottery room. Okay. 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 Nope. 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 Ha ha. Ah! Okay. Ooh, that was close. <laughs> that was really close. That was a close one. Okay. I, know we, I know we need to fight them, but also, I know. Like, I, know. Eh. I will. Key okay. time. You insert the key into the keyhole and open the door. Nice. Okay. Okay, yes. <laughs> All right, yeah. We had to we find go. one soon. Weird smelly one! What? Free crest sadness! Let's go! Okay. Little mini boss time. Yep. I'm curious when they'll tell us what, uh, what Bonnie's picking up on. Yeah, that's true. Bonnie is has commented on the smells, right? Just that there there's something weird about now now they have, but also just that there's there's something weird about these sadness. Yeah, yeah. Bonnie points something out every single time. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Interesting. Okay, we're gonna just hit it and see what's going on. It's probably. I'm gonna guess that it's rock because it's rock. Sif was weak. To you were hit. absolutely right. I wasn't paying attention. That was that, that's no. a very very good call. No worries. Uh, um, I was paying attention too much to um, the wrong thing. <laughs> it's all good. Well, in that case, paper craft time. Mm -hmm. Let's nice. do this thing. Yeah. Oh, done. Oh, easy. easy. <laughs> <laughs> Same hat. Yeah. Fifty. Fifty. Hell yeah. Got a star crest. Perfect. Woohoo! All right, Boniface. What do you mean by weird smelly? Those sadness all smell really sugary. That's it? <laughs> I mean, that's something. Hole in the wall. Hole doesn't really bring you anywhere. Boniface, what about this wall? What does it smell like? Like a crabbing wall! <laughs> <laughs> that sure is a broken pillar. I love the whole thing with crabs. I know it's a it's a really fun like recurring bit. Okay, this is this is the, we're done. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay, we're we're gonna fight at least one more fight to get to fifty. Yeah, I, I'm surprised that Isabel got to fifty, but 
Do we have it? Yeah. <laughs> um, Sif must have been uh, time stopped. That's right. Yeah. They were at one point. Mm -hmm. Actually, in a couple fights. Yeah. Uh, this thing is paper. It is indeed. Bop, bop, bop. Whoa. Hell yeah. Uh, yeah. Nice. And honestly, just probably. Yeah, I was yeah. about to say, I feel like even with the resist, we're good. Nice. 50. Okay. There we go. I'm going to go heal. Good call. Don't want to waste any items on heal that. Heal. Save our save our levels. Yep. Everything's good. Save, save, save. Awesome. Okay. Cool. Um, actually, sorry, while I'm doing that, mm -hmm. I don't think anything meaningful has happened between uh, now and when we made our safety save. So I'm going to just... Make a safety save. Make a second safety save. Good call. All right. Uh, where to next? Uh, back. We need to decide which wall we want to use the crest on. So we have one. Sorry, no, it's up. Up. We have yeah. one here, and then we have one in a hallway. Which one do you want to use? Well, we're already here. We could do this one. Okay. Yeah. Okay. You have a star crest, so use the star crest. Yeah. Free path time. You use the star crest. Cool. All right, let's see what this gets us. Oh, okay. Oh, Ooh. interesting. I think uh, this was probably the wrong route. It's a dead but, end. But also, I'm very intrigued. Yeah. Oh. Whoa! Where are we? There's a big window over there, see? What? Was there a room like this in the house? Yeah. Yeah, I remember. Someone was working here. Studying. They looked like... Um, sorry, I, I can't remember. Good news! There's no key or knife in here, Stardust! Dead end. Dead end, yeah. Okay. That, that's bad, hey, that's bad news! <laughs> yeah, that's not great. Um, Rolled up paper, you unroll one. It's a star chart. Ooh. Rolled up paper, you unroll one. It's also a star chart. Okay. That's, there. That's this is like, hey, if you need to everywhere. abort. Uh, a pile of papers. Something is written on them. Looks like a child tried to write down their first word. That sure is some awful handwriting. And a determined child. Looks like they tried to write the same word on all of those papers. Oh. Is it an open open phrase? Please? A pile of papers. Something is written on them. Can we can we look any closer? No. Oh. What okay, about that's just the same st I get okay. Yeah. Um I'm I'm gonna come back to the thing in the middle in a moment. Okay. A world globe. Here we are. Isabeau points to where you are on the lower half of the globe. Vogard, the land of change. Kabue is here. Odile po uh, points to a big country far from Vogard. Uh, Kabue, a country you visited a at least once. And Bambush is here. Bonnie points to a spot almost at on the edge of Vogard. You spin the globe and jab your finger on a random spot. Oh, is that? Is that where you're from, Sif? You smile mysteriously. Mm. What does this smile mean? You laugh and don't explain. No, because we don't know where we're from. No. Although yeah. we can intuit from what Bonnie said earlier that it's pretty close to where Bambouche is. Yes. Yeah, because... Yep. They, they they said like the town over one over got yep. hit. Yep. yep. Uh, a telescope. It's dusty. What's that? Am I making that up or did a town one over get time stopped? I think I thought a town one over got time stopped. Okay. Bonnie but... said something about because wasn't Bonnie the one that brought up the island that disappeared first? Oh. I could be wrong about that. I I'm, don't know. I'm having a hard time remembering. Yeah. Potentially. Which is, which is funny. Yeah. <laughs> um, we're in character. Uh, yeah, we yeah. Can't we can't remember. Anything about the, yeah. <laughs> uh, oh, I've seen one of those before. That's a telescope. I think you watch the sky with it. Like clouds? Like stars, I think. During the night, since they're not here during the day. Stars. Boring. Mm. A pillar. Can you click on the window? Yeah, I, I absolutely can. I, I'm just trying to... Check everything else. Okay, there we go. A cool. big window. Those are stars, right? 
I remembered just now. But don't they only appear at night? We left early in the morning, so it should still be light outside. I've heard it's always nighttime near the king. Hey, why did you just remember stars? Yeah, that was weird. Huh. I remember stars. That was weird. Maybe this is his influence? It was dark around the house yesterday too, remember? Hmm. Okay. Okay. Some books. Just looking at them gives you a headache. Ooh! Written right. in the language? Yeah, let's yeah. see. There's a book in Kabuin on top of the table. Oh. You all look at Odile. A uh, Kabuin book here in Vogard. How rare. The title translates to Colors Through Time. It seems to be an essay about color theory. Color theory. What's a color? We don't have time for this. Yeah, you really don't. You don't really care. <laughs> 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 a star chart. What's this drawing for? This looks pretty good. Not really. It's just dots on lightless paper. I could do that. The dots on the map look like the sky we can see through the window. Could it be some kind of drawing of the stars? A map of the stars? But what for? You gently touch the map. For some reason, you can feel yourself frowning. Ooh, I love the little lore bits. I love that Sif is a big old mystery. I agree with that wholeheartedly. Okay. I think... And like, why is it just Sif looping that's like, a great i mean you yeah know, i think that's sort of like the core question yeah um, like why is sif looping yeah yeah like it obviously has to do with the the missing island i think in some way yeah, yeah. i think that that probably <laughs> definitely plays into it yep uh okay i'm gonna i'm, I'm gonna <laughs> off myself if we're okay with that Bye. yeah looping yeah. time okay okay Blech. Let's do a quick little reset. Yep. Okay. We... I, I think we just want to come back, right? We, we don't... Just, yeah. Oh my god. Is there anything else? No. Not not off the top of my head. No, we just want to go back yep. and try the other door. Or, yeah. sorry, the other, uh... You know, tier. Scary. Right? Bonnie seems to be thinking about something. Okay, sorry. Okay. I, I'm gonna be completely honest. I wanted to see whether we could try the other food. Oh um. <laughs> yeah, that would have been nice. I, it seems like this is past the food, though. Yeah, yeah. I, I th that's exactly my conclusion. Okay, we need to go get keys. We have to go back and get the keys again. Yes. Yeah. All right. Fast forward. Yeah. Okay. okay. Yeah. There's a key on the floor. Pick it up. It's the empty key, which we still haven't used. Okay. We'll deal with that in a moment. Um. Oh, is this new? I, I, huh. Well, judging by its location, I'm guessing this is the key for the gate just ahead, but... Okay, we're not okay. gonna do that. Nope. Well. <laughs> <laughs> it's a steak! I was about to say that it's a piece of meat! Why is it a steak? With legs! <laughs> I mean, aren't we all just pieces of meat with legs? You know what? You're right. You're absolutely right. <laughs> Get out of here. <laughs> Nice! Oh, level 50. That's We just great. need Mira. Uh, okay. So... I almost suggested that we just load back a save, but that would not have tracked this progress. Yeah, that was my concern is I don't know. I'm not sure how relevant Sif's memories are. Like, I don't think this is like a Sigma situation, but I could be wrong. Yeah, that's um, fair. Yeah. But in lieu of knowing how that works, I feel like it's good to, mm -hmm. to internalize. Sigma! I agree. But I, I, I have the impulse to look back too. <laughs> Fido! Fido! <laughs> I'm a Siggy. Yeah, me too. Oh, He's a real weirdo, but I am a, a fan. Real weirdo. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh man. Uh, okay. All right. So we have to get. We need keys. Both of the keys. I Two went to keys. the wrong room. That's the. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. It's fine. I don't remember where to go. I'm trusting you. I typically remember, but I might not this time <laughs> because it may have been a little while since we played this last. Come here. Since Come we here. got those first keys. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> ah! 
<laughs> it backfired. It did backfire. It That's fun. okay. Mirabelle needs to level up anyway. This one's like garlic. I know we already fought this one. Yeah. But... <laughs> or a butt. I don't know. Yes. A <laughs> little bit. A little bit of column A. A little bit of column B. I think. Get wrecked. <laughs> Mira, please level up. <laughs> Mira, come on. We know you're strong. Okay, oh, that's the path we need to- No. Okay, so there's three. Wait, this is the photo. Where's the fucking key? <laughs> there's a path there. I know I can equip the thing that tells me where the keys are. Do I need to equip the thing that yes. tells me where the keys are? Yes, you Fuck. know where the keys are, so just equip the thing that tells us where the keys are. I, I say. I'm doing it, I'm doing it. Memory cool. of keys. All right. How, how does it work? How does it work? <laughs> I was about to say. How does it work? Is there a map? There isn't like a map or anything, I don't think right? so. Is how does the key, how does the memory of keys work? <sighs> Can you look at the item again? Yeah. Uh, equip, recif, memory of keys. This castle is full of keys. When interacting with a locked door, get directions on where the key oh, is. Oh, that's not helpful. Uh. Because <laughs> I know where the- I'm on the right side. I know where the key for the right side is. It's the key for the left side. It's the key of this- uh, it's the sadness key that I'm trying to remember. Yeah, because we know where the angry key is. Yeah. But, well, shit. Which- which- <laughs> okay, give me a moment, give me a moment, give me a moment. Oh no. Okay, it's there's not, really- not in here. I know, this there's nothing in here, and then there's a wall. Sorry, I'm just like, give me a sec. And then there's a locked door. Fuck off. What's, what's locked what's door. In there? This is the this is the locked door. Oh. This is the thing that's opened by the angry key. Oh right, that's um, the angry key one. Okay. Okay. So then, it must, by definition, be. Oh my fucking. <laughs> <laughs> Fine. <laughs> Don't you want to fight this garlic butt? <laughs> I, I, don't, I don't. I'm fine. <laughs> oh, it's fine. These things die in one hit. Yeah. I just need to get to the hit. Yep. Get out of here. Bye. Maybe Mirabelle will level up now. Nope. nope. <laughs> okay. okay, what's in here? Oh my. Oh my god. <laughs> it's this, and then there's the. This gets us to the. To the this. To the. Yeah, the secret passage. Yeah, but there was nothing in the secret passage. Yeah. Which is funny that you can't skip this. I mean, you can because. I mean, I like, guess we technically already yeah, did it. Yeah, there's nothing here. Yeah. So I'm not going to do that. And then there's nothing sparkling in here, right? I don't no. see anything sparkling. No. No. Okay. Shit. Where, where's the where's the key? Where's the sadness door? The sadness door is on the uh, is on the the left side. Uh, maybe maybe go to the sadness door and just use memory of keys. Okay. Ah, uh, because we don't. Fine. Yeah, sorry. I'm sorry. No, I'm doing it. Here we go. Uh, at this point, I'm like, <laughs> this is annoying. I uh, I don't want to uh, think too hard about it. I just want it to be like keys over there. Yeah, go for it. Memory of keys. <laughs> <laughs> Where's the key? Shaped like a smiling, huh? Right side in the room with the mirror. It was on it the was? right side in the room with the mirror? It's the one we walked in multiple times. Yeah, I thought, just now. I yeah. thought that wasn't it. Okay. Well, clearly it was. Memory of keys oh tells my God. us. I guess it was on the floor in the back. I just didn't see the sparkle. I didn't either. I genuinely didn't yeah, see Yeah, I it. didn't see the sparkle. Okay. But. Sometimes that happens, That's I guess. Fine. Super sparkle heal. Heal Odile. <laughs> uh, and now you go, Odile. Yeah. Finish it off. Big, big paper smack. Bam. Bam. All right. Cool. <laughs> okay. Okay. Like, I know it's on this side. Fuck. It, um, it's fine. Mirabelle needs to fucking level. I know. I, it, and these are so quick and easy that yeah. like, it's fine. It's like, might as well. Although, why are you faster now? Oh, because I because I have memory of keys equipped. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Instead of memory of self. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I need to swap back to memory of self. <laughs> <laughs> and put memory of keys on just right, right when we, we need it. But we, we won't need it anymore because uh -uh. we now know where all the keys are. Yes. Uh, 
Cool. Memory of self. Okay. All right. Back to the mirror. The mirror door. Okay. Okay. Please, 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 please. There's no sparkle. To the right of it. Go to the right of it. Okay. Maybe it's important that we get the photo. Maybe. Uh huh. Uh huh. Okay. Oh yeah, and then it shows up. <gasps> okay. Clearly That's the photo is right. important. Um, yeah. And and then the key appears. Okay. okay well, I feel a little key. less silly because it it wasn't there. No, that's true. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. If there was no sparkle. We had to do that. Um, cool. And and that tells us something about the photo. Yep. I that is a canon <laughs> event. That is interesting. Yeah. Uh, and uh, yeah, that we have to get the photo every time is basically yep. what that means. Okay. That's Honestly, it was kind event. of worth loading back to learn that that's a canon event. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Um, crucial. All right, go, DL. I actually am incredibly grateful that they've been feeding me these garlic boys because we've gotten <laughs> a lot of experience off of them. We have. It's true. Yeah. Yay! Thank you, Mira. Shining Shine life. What is that? M uh, Mirabel just learned a new skill. Oh, thank change. I'll be able to help out more. What does that do? You got the memory of shining life. Cool. You'll always remember this. Cool. When equipped, your housemaiden will be able to use shining life as a skill even if she isn't level 50. Shining life is a skill that revives a KO'd ally. Oh, nice. Nice. Okay. Resurrection. We got resurrection. We did indeed. Love it. Okay. Okay. There we go. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Okay. There's a certain logic to me going back around and picking up all the dang tonics that I've missed. Uh, this. Oh, oh, we have to do all of this. I don't. I I, don't. I just clicked yeah. on it by accident. I meant to click on this. Oh, we got the the gizmo gadget. Oh yeah. So actually, I did. Yeah, you didn't need to do that. that again. Yeah, I'll yep. go get the clay too, just for. Yeah, we need the clay, and we also needed issue eighty-seven. Of yep. The book. Yes, we do. Which means I'm not gonna click on it here. Um, I'll do that on the way back out. Okay. Let's get this. Yep. Okay. Ooh, sorry. It's a bummer that all of those good conversations we had uh, are gone. Are gone. Uh -huh. <laughs> they're lost to the ether. I mean, I guess they're t with ours and Sif's memory. Yeah. But they are. Uh, it's just you know. It's sad that they don't exist in this timeline. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. So does that does are those like tonics all stacking? Like, do we have them from previous loops and now we we just picked up more? Uh no, we we the ones I picked up from the last loop are gone. Okay. These 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 fuckers, they're insistent. Come over here. Come over here. Come over here. <laughs> nice. <gasps> it's Start. fine. You have to. You, <laughs> I agree. I you have to actually click on it. You're right. You're right. I just I didn't mean to be so scared. No, I loved it. It was a perfect reaction. Let me get the clay. Okay. Cool. Da -da -da -da. Got the clay. Take that. Where was issue eighty-seven? I think it was. This? It's this. Yeah. Yes. There oh, we go. Perfect. 87. Two and one. Do we want to fake re see if we remember what a. Oh, uh, weird. It didn't is? say you should remember this, so. <gasps> oh, maybe we just already did? I guess, but that one time. Hmm. I don't know. Okay. Interesting. I might have to. Oh. Ha ha. Ha ha. All right. Okay. All right. Which Back way do we want to get go? the crest. Okay. First, we have to do the fight. Get the fight. Yep. yep. Up fight time. Here. Yeah. Fight time. Yep. And then we have. To, we have two options okay weird smelly one let's fight it it's rock unless it changes every loop let's find out okay let's see um i guess hit it with paper and then we'll still yes yeah okay it's rock okay so yep. turn it up to a deal yeah i was okay. debating whether i wanted to speed up first but i think we can mm. just it seemed pretty neat last time yeah <gasps> I think we're fine. Uh, <laughs> Level two, so. Yeah, I think we're A-okay. Yeah. Take this. Oh. And you could honestly, yeah. Yep. Yep. Wow, amazing. Okay. Super. Star crest. Uh, which way do you want to go? <gasps> right or left, I, I guess feel like are I, options. I picked wrong last time, so I think you should pick this time. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. I don't think this is the right option, but I do want to do it. 
Okay. Let's go right. Okay. Well, it's literally the right option, but not the correct one necessarily. That's fair. Yep. Okay. Let's, and we're already here as yep. well, which is what I that said was last sort time. Of, yeah, I know. I say, <laughs> I, exact same logic. I was like, I could run over to the left, but I do know there's one over here, so let's just do it. Which makes me think that it's wrong because it's going to want you to run all the way over to yep, the left. Yep. I, I, that's why I was like, I don't think God this is... Yeah, I was like, I don't think this is correct. <laughs> but... Now now we know the third one's right. We should just use our gamer brains. And yeah. Actually like we're, <laughs> no, but we're doing the gamer brain thing because if we got the right option, I'd be like, well, I wonder what was behind those wrong ones. True. True. I bet there was something cool. Uh, Uh-oh. Wrong way, Stardust. <laughs> Shut up. Jack. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> well, there's going to be something in there's here. There's going to be. That's the thing is there's going to be something in yeah. here. You pick up one at random. It's a poem about a fox and a crow. Oh. There's a bunch of unfinished poems on the desk. Isabeau slaps his hand on one of them. Mira! Yes, yes, I'm reading. Unf oranges are nice. Oranges are soft. Oranges are frail. When you look at me, I feel like one. Your fingernail digs into my cheek. Peel an orange open. The poem ends here. <laughs> Fascinating. Is this a clue? No, it's just someone's unfinished poem. Are oranges soft? I don't think is that a is that a thought that anyone has ever had? I don't think of them as soft because I peeled an orange on the way here and it took me almost the whole drive to peel that orange. <laughs> That's my critique of the poem. <laughs> Unless That's I had... the hole I choose to pick in it. Uh huh. Well, I mean, I guess depending on the orange, like there are some oranges where as soon as you break them, the the peel just comes completely off. You know, Aren't like a like, like a mandarin. Clementines? Yeah, like a clementine or a mandarin orange or like a like a. Oh, uh, I almost said pomelo, but that's wrong. No, no. pomelos are like... Those are the big ones <laughs> yeah. that are all pissed. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. <laughs> That's not what happens no. with those. What am I thinking of? Uh, like a clementine. Yeah, like, like a, a cutie. A cutie, yes. But those aren't oranges. They're citrus. <laughs> that taste like citrus and sweet. They're in the same family Fine. for me. Fine. Uh, 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 what? The oh, my God. Like... They're not. I keep my brain is it's like not pomelo. a pomelo. It's definitely not, not a, pomelo. a pomelo. That's the one thing I can say. Uh, tangelo. It's a tangelo. It's a tangerine crossed with a pomelo, and they're very good. And they're okay. easy to peel. And they're kind of soft. But <laughs> that's not what they said. They didn't say t tangelos. Tangelo. <laughs> 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 also, do they have the concept of oranges in a world with no color? Whoa. <laughs> Something to ruminate on. Whoa. <laughs> Fascinating. What if they have color in a different part of this world? That would be really interesting. What if Kabue is all in color? That would be super interesting. <laughs> oh my god. Let's finish it for them. Do we have time? Do we really have time to do this right now? Peel an orange open. Orange juice comes out. Oh, gems. Um, um, peel an orange open. The person who wrote this is an orange, right? That seems to be the interpretation, yes. Okay, so I die. Mm -hmm. Very literal, very nice. Blood oranges? Oh. Something with that? I love this workshop thing Something we're doing. Something bloody, but poetic. I haven't heard a single good idea yet. Madame, do you have something then? No. <laughs> <laughs> I love that lot. The programmed in pauses in this game are really funny. I don't know if that's clearly conveyed to people that aren't the literal ones clicking it, but there's a lot of programmed in pauses that, that give you a sense of how the characters are feeling. That's hilarious. That one was really good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, leaving us young people to do the job. I get it. Sif, your turn. Peel an orange open. 
It gets very appealing. I like that. <laughs> yeah. Ha! <laughs> Sifrin. You take a bow. No one except as a bow claps. <laughs> yeah, it's my guy. <laughs> <laughs> There's a note with the word open phrase one, two, three written on it. Wow. You look a little closer. Is that an open phrase or something? Yeah, it is. We know which door it goes to. Do we? Okay. It's are there any other doors that have open phrase? Yeah. There's the in one in floor town. three. Huh? In, not in floor three. Well, but. That is what makes me think that this open phrase doesn't go to the floor three door. Oh. Right? Because this game doesn't do that. It doesn't like, it likes having things scattered all over the place. That's true. Yeah. So it could go, so it could go to that. I'm just trying to think of all the open phrase doors. Uh -huh. There's that one. There's the one in town. Uh-huh. Isn't there one other one on on floor two? I think so. Okay, so. I thought we opened that one though. We opened the one on floor. Or on floor one. One. Okay. Is there one on floor two? Oh shit. <laughs> Yeah, oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I don't know. Well, well, it's fine. We know at least two, possibly three doors this could go to. Okay, <laughs> cool. That sounds very safe and not at all stupid. Hmm. Okay. Okay. So we'll just, now we have to just try it on all the doors. Yep. You find an anthology of horror stories. Uh oh, which chateau are we going to get? On the cover, a handsome young man looks into the night, fearfully, but longingly. <laughs> Ooh, Mira, this looks like the kind of books you like, right? Horror books? This one is massive! What's this one called? That's the handsome young man falling into beautiful, heartbreaking madness horror anthology! <laughs> Whoa. Mirabelle's yelling made you jump. Did... Did someone in the house have it this whole time?! Did someone keep it from you? What is it, anyway? It's a full anthology all about pure-hearted boys being subjected to awful monsters and horror situations seeing them screaming in fright oh i cannot help but root for them and at the same time be happy i am not in their situation <laughs> <laughs> there's something so lovingly touching about these tales something wonderfully hopeful i cannot help but there's a cat in my way <laughs> Corey, Corey, I can't read the screen. Corey, come here. I cannot help but read them and pray for their survival. Oh, great, Corey. How's hey, that? Hey, baby. Come here. Yeah. Yeah, hey, little muse. I hear you. Yeah, go to Allison's lap. Come to my lap then now. Then she won't be able to read. <laughs> yeah, I'm actually, I think I'm okay. Oh, hi. Oh, happy cat. Hello. Oof. So, so do they usually survive? Or do the monsters catch them? Well, 50-50. Uh, oh, what? But also, the catharsis that fills my whole being when they get caught. <laughs> There's something very wonderful about that, too. Uh, the schadenfreude? The schadenfreude! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, cat farces. <laughs> cat farces. Cat farces. <laughs> cat farces. Scadenfrober. Don't worry about it, Bon Bon. I too am also lost. It's just. It's very good. It's very moving. Makes me feel like I went on a run. <laughs> and also, sometimes the heroes end up bonding with the monsters, too. <gasps> what? Oh, romance. I understand the romance part. I understand all those parts, actually. Any books you'd recommend? Absolutely! I'll lend you some of my favorites once we... Uh, well, once we finally escape a horror tale of our own, I suppose. <laughs> Uh, I'm looking forward to it. Oh my god, Cory is purring so intensely. It's like I can feel it in my bones. She's so good. She's so happy. She's purring so happy hard cat. right now. It's so cute. Some books all lined up. There's a space in between two books, like someone removed it. Ah, uh, Bonnie seems to be reading it intently. It has a very striking cover with a moodoo clay figurine with large sunken eyes and a screaming mouth. You can't read the title. You're curious. What do you have there? Uh, 
Bonnie hides the book in their pocket. N nothing It's nothing! Nothing at all! Sure. Okay. Shut up! It's fine! I'm fine! S -s Stop looking at it! Stop looking at me! New sprite. <laughs> yeah, that's cute! Shut up! Here, take this book instead! Bonnie shoves a book at you. Sneezing. How to expulse bad thoughts. <laughs> wow. What did you find, Bonnie? <laughs> what did you find, Bonnie? <laughs> What I'm we sorry, get? I'm just vaguely to... curious if it, if something showed up, but no. Uh, are you looking for sneezing? Like the book? Oh no, if if Bonnie has the book in their pockets, <gasps> so I was just curious. Oh, gotcha. Some vials. Why does it matter? <laughs> We're resetting. <laughs> God damn it. Why does it matter? Yeah. A note for a festival that's supposed to take place today. Hmm. Is there nothing else in here? I don't think so. There's no hidden corners or no. I think I think we just got a wall. cute scene with orange. We got that's it. Okay. All right. Time to reset. All right. I have a question though. Yep. Oh, do we want to reset and continue next time? Yeah. I think I think so. I think the reset is easy, reset but I do right think now. we should uh, continue next time. We'll get all the keys. And then we will try the third path. <laughs> we will go the correct way next time, we promise. Indeed. <laughs> we'll see you then. Bye.